Hello everyone, it's Mr. Juicer here, casting some Yomi action. I've got Ju on the line, and we are casting Riker vs. Raziak. Yep, to Panda Boys. To Panda Riker. Boys. Oh, the two and the three! Ah! Oh! Riker <laughs> starts with the better draw, hashtag, uh, nice draws, think to Mad King. <laughs> Shoutouts because... to the Salt Czar. Yep, for the Salt Bowl. You know, gotta <laughs> give credit where credit is due. Absolutely. Okay. Um, sick combo, fourteen see. damage. Yeah, okay damage for uh, for one card, I guess, because you get one free from uh, Shen and you get an honest draw, so free damage all around. Good blocks. Yep, Raz got to his two, but unfortunately it didn't matter. I like the uh, I, I like to think that he had that two in uh, in his opening hand and just played the three for a uh, for a value trap. But either way, oh, okay, <laughs> never no. mind. <laughs> no, and Raz, uh, he mashes that too as soon as he knows he got it. <laughs> yeah, I guess, did not work. I guess you can't, you can't afford to be too cute in this matchup. If you get knocked on your ass, it's friggin' terror town. <laughs> like, yeah, it, it definitely is. Let's see what they show us. Okay, opens with the Q. What does that tell us about Raz's hand? tells us that uh oh sick nans um, it tells us that he wants to blow up throw and didn't have one fast enough to do it ah. i think possibility that he doesn't have uh or didn't feel comfortable playing any high normals probably uh but he has life lead now yeah so uh, he's got the we'll knockdown see, we'll see meaty or well, actually we might see a block this is actually the interesting part of the mix-up because normally you would think Riker is just like i'm gonna crash bomb on wake up and he did, but uh, Raziak <laughs> sniffed it out. Yeah. I guess this was a test. The first one was a test. <laughs> um, That's interesting because I think uh, I think Raz is a, a good uh, pro or a strong proponent of um, like prove to me that you will. Otherwise, I'm not going to respect it. Yeah, um, but he knows Riker's a crazy man. That's true. Uh, oh, nice. I, Cheeky I three. Yeah, I actually thought the the way that that interaction was going to go. Uh oh, Oof. drew another two. Yeah, that's a problem. Needs the knockdown, I think. But the the thing that I thought he was going to do, Riker, on the last wake up was I thought he was going to throw him on wake up. Ah, uh, okay. Riker, Riker is a big proponent of that uh, because everybody expects that he's going to hit buttons on wake up, so he's just like, okay, cool. You're going to pick a defensive option. I'm going to throw it. So yeah. makes sense. Double crash bomb. Ooh. Yep. First one was a test, second one was, okay, you don't get to play. <laughs> it's my turn now. Yeah, I, I like the, um, I mean, it's, again, it's good odds. He could have, uh, he could have just drawn that anyway, but um, I like blocking the second time, just because it makes the fact that he doesn't have king more real. Oh, and there's, <laughs> there's Rattus. Nope, it's actually my turn again. Yeah. <laughs> Does pay for it for, uh, I mean, basically a trade, but gets the knockdown and has huge life lead, so. Yeah. Doing pretty good here. Uh, yeah, Riker's powering up. I was just like, <laughs> is this time? Yep. Oh my god! The, time. <laughs> the realness, so. the realness is, is pretty real. <laughs> so we're, we're playing the scramble now. Oh. This is exactly what Riker wanted. Yep. So, up. Uh, uh oh. <laughs> uh, oh. <laughs> do we ah, see yes. do we see the, <laughs> the double <joust>. KO? <laughs> uh it's time to joust or threat the joust. Uh, very very classic DRB tech. Yeah. Uh, nice. Yes, Good her, dodge. Raziak was not having any of that. <laughs> <laughs> Raz did not want to joust. And no face down either, so just uh just kill him, I guess. No, okay, knock him down. Go. He he's basically unless he bursts, which I mean, knowing Riker, he might have a burst back there. Maybe that's why he threw the anarchy. Um, but two knowing kings Riker, already played. I think you just yeah, yeah. With two kings and a discard, I think you just go for your uh, your odd uh, odd normal there. Yep, and this should be lethal anyway. Yeah. Uh, so Riker wanted to shake things up. <laughs> and wanted to see if he could blow up Raz, frazzle him, but uh, Raz very proficient in the Zane Ditto. Yeah, uh, Riker's going right back into it. <laughs> uh, the thing I, that's the thing that's messed up is uh, I think Raz has something ridiculous, like like a sixty-five or a seventy percent win rate in the Ditto. 
Yeah. Like, gah. I mean, that that's that experience. Yeah. I, uh, I thought that Riker was switching to Grave 100%. Um, yeah, I'm surprised. I guess he wants to he wants to prove to him, like he wants to prove something. Shake him up, like, really badly by beating him with his own character. But I don't know if that's really going to work. Like... I think you, you know, if you play the the ditto often enough, and you you're playing your main, you just you just accept that. Okay, yeah, sometimes, especially with this with this matchup where things can just like you can just not have answers in your hand and just get destroyed. So yeah, I don't know. Yeah, and I I know uh, Raz is basically fresh off foreing Tales of Dawn, you know, so yeah, he's clearly comfortable in the matchup. Definitely. Maybe. Okay, so he does get put on his back. Yep. We've seen one king each. Oh, no, 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 it was a jack. Never mind. Yep. Throw on wake There up. we go. Yep. Uh, again, I, I thought Riker was going to be the person that went to that card. <laughs> but uh, it seems like Raz took a page from more of the Riker school. Cause <laughs> it's, a, that throw game. it's a good school to go to. You got you to gotta attend at least vocationally. Like, go like two, two weeks in the year take that 101 course yeah exactly <laughs> yeah yeah <Get> defeated. <laughs> yeah make sure you buy your books used though like you don't need to uh yeah you shouldn't pay new for that one yeah <laughs> yeah there we go in. We yep don't five. care very nice just gonna do it hope he so. flips uh, a jack here he's getting a little bit low hand here uh, Riker shouldn't burst this, so I don't think this is too much of a, a thought yeah. process. Okay. So, uh, that's gonna have some healthy damage. Mm -hmm. You're going to use... Well, you could use either one. Probably to make yourself feel better, you're gonna use the seven. Oh, nope. There you go. There's the damage. Yep, and the knockdown, so... Yeah, we'll have very important. <laughs> Six cards, uh, time for Riker to check his cell phone. Um... Six uh, card hand. Don't wake up. No. Blocks. Good cross up. Oh. oh. That is a sick Nance. Wow, 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 wow. <laughs> that is pretty brutal. If, uh, oh, okay. It doesn't matter. Still, yep, yeah, still he still has, has jacks. Yeah. But if he ever does get put on his back, it could be horrible city. <laughs> like. So, if you're Raz here, do you just say forget it and throw the third crash bomb? No. Okay. Yeah, no. Definitely not. Just just play the mix-up. Until... Yeah, now, this is definitely a prove-you-can-stop-me prove situation. Yeah. Uh, probably, like, throw six here. Yeah. No. Oh! Uh, first bait, he gets Good the stuff. Stand. Yeah. I mean, at that point... At that point, I feel like you should just play the burst on wake up. Like, I don't know. Oh, I see. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's a good point. Undercut. Oof. Yep. So Oof. This, this should be game. Yeah. <laughs> now the question is, oh, oh my god, oh, is oh. that the second Joker? <laughs> oh my it's god! He did it again. <laughs> wow. Wow! Wow! <laughs> I think I think you gotta switch out after this. If you're like, <laughs> this is not this is not the way you want to go out. And Mister yeah. Two again. Yeah. <laughs> God damn. Oh, does he have the other ace just to finish it off too? Yeah. <laughs> I'm liking these uh I'm liking this 30 second speed Yomi on medium timer. <laughs> yeah. Uh a get Wow, okay. I I am unsure about this stratagem. I don't like this. Uh but I don't know. I guess yeah, Riker is planning to go down with the ship, I guess. Yeah. I don't like it, but hey, I mean he He's doing what he wants, I, I guess. guess. <laughs> that is that is definitely Riker's style. We'll see if uh, see if it pays out. Okay, yeah, go into the block range. We saw very very aggressive games from both uh, players uh, in in both first games. So 
see what happens now that uh, Riker has made blocking a button. Ooh. Oh, throw immediately. Yeah. Uh, so contrary to I, I would say no, I, I like to joke around and say that Riker is kind of a crazy person, um, but I, I think that's only in certain situations. He's there are some players that I, I think I would categorize as being like buttonsy, you know, yeah. a person that wants to like hit buttons all the time. But Riker actually isn't really one of them. No, for sure. I mean, he can play a very he he. Uh, what do you call the um, what's the PR og thing? Uh, the daywalker. Right? Oh yeah, daywalker. <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah. I yeah, I I would categorize Riker in some extents to be a daywalker. Yeah. but he's he's not a a dedicated daywalker. He sometimes he he puts it to bed. You know, sometimes yeah, yeah. He, he, he retires can, for the night. Yeah, yeah. He puts away uh, the mask, right? <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah, sometimes he puts away the mask. Uh, but in this matchup, I I think you shouldn't put away the mask. You should yeah. you should daywalk one hundred percent. I think that's where Raziak actually is is chumping him. Um, he's he's playing the range that I I kind of expect Riker to have been playing. Uh, Interesting. So, because he ha he has been playing, I feel like the more aggressive range. Mm -hmm. Ooh, there we go. Yeah, I mean this this is okay. Yeah, I mean, I mean he has at three cards in hand, and now uh, Raz has a chance to just try to sit on him as as hard as possible. Yeah, I mean he powered twos, so I mean, what is he starting his offense with if not crash bomb or burst? Mm -hmm. Um. So, I mean, if Raz really wants to, I think he can play defensive. I think we see throws from Raz. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. Plays the twos to try to undercut and uh, gets dodged. So we probably see a jack or a king on the end of this. Uh, I would probably use nine. Yeah, Riker wants to... Yeah, that's fair. Just much the mileage out. Costs him one card. That's perfectly fine. Goes up uh, 13 life now. Of course, with uh, seven cards in hand, uh, Raz can get that back real fast. Yeah. Good yep, throw. Yeah. So, um... Okay. Loses a king, but... This will be like Q7 or 7 jack, probably, mm -hmm. by this point. 6-7. Six, 6-7, seven. Six, seven. yeah, nice. So he has life lead now. Yeah. Six point life lead. Still um, very close. Uh, I don't know if... It's possible that Riker might not have enough damage in hand to kill off of anything. And Raz is... Ooh, okay. Never mind. Things just got very dicey. <laughs> very, very dicey. That was actually a good crash bomb. I, I think Raz was not really planning to play a defensive option. No, 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 no. I think you see... I think Raz sees 20, car, or 20 health Riker and goes... Uh, I'm going to knock his block off. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He's going to go murder him. Uh, Raz might burst on wake up. And if this gets baited, crash bomb. Okay. okay. Good trade. Good trade. This definitely puts uh, puts the next combat in uh, Raz's favor. Yep. Wake up crash bomb uh, is potentially very rude. Uh, which makes wake up throw very rude as well. Yep. Although with three cards in hand, I think you don't respect the king. Yep. Okay. Raz feeling uncomfortable. Wants to, yeah, playing around the king there. Yep. And uh, this makes things really awkward for Riker because now he loses on a throw, uh, ace ace range. Right. Because he doesn't have a neutral button that beats it. And Raz uh, favors AA, I think, a little bit. Yeah. Yep. Oh. Gets out of there. And this could very well be lethal unless we have a second Joker. Q. Yep. Uh, so it's not going to be lethal, I don't think. I'm pretty sure Riker doesn't have another crash bomb. Oh, wait, no. Yeah, he he's had... at seven. Oh, it was the other Joker. Yep. Wow. <laughs> one more one. <laughs> Shout okay. out to Skullgirls. Yeah. I mean, it's, this is still treated mostly the same, I think. Uh, Raziak, if he has another two, mashes it or he throws. Crash bomb. Nice. And that is a wrap. Yep. So, Raz sitting on match point. Yep. 
Do we see the Switch or do we stick? I mean, if you've played uh, three... If you've played three games, you might as well stick it. Yeah. <laughs> it's like, now is not the time to start feeling uncomfortable. Like, <laughs> I mean, no, four no. insane things. I, even, <laughs> even on the front end, I didn't think Riker was going to take four Zane games. From yeah. So he has to switch. I mean, I know um, there's like a playoff after this, and obviously Riker... I don't like him doing it, but like if this is, I'm gonna test him out and do some stuff, and I I, I will assume that I'll see him later. Uh, right. That sort of play, I mean, like yeah, you can do it. You're not really giving Raz any information. You're allowing him to kind of come back because Raz's uh, record actually is not very great in Tapanda right now. Right. Um. So I don't know. Like we, uh, I think generally people know that. Riker's best character right now is Grave. Um, but he's just going to play it out. <laughs> yeah, Raz smelling blood. <laughs> yep, there's the two. So I, I honestly, I'm almost willing to call this set right here. Um, it, I mean, there's so much momentum on Raz's side right now. Yeah. Let's probably throw into nine. Nine? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Jack yep. is way better to combo into. Might as well get the free throw damage anyway. <clears throat> he didn't have a Q, because obviously that was going Q, 9J. Yeah. Hit, but, uh, block, yep. Okay. So now, now Riker is, is, uh, is, getting, uh, is able to stand up because um, of the first few games. Yeah, but he, he hasn't really won neutral since like the first interaction of the first game. And yeah. now, there we know, go. That three. Okay. What uh, what do we got off of this? Potentially some damage, but definitely want to go for the knockdown here if you've got it. Yeah. So does does he have the Q Jack? We're gonna find out. If he has a throw, it's probably going to go into nine. Yeah. Q nine J. There we go. Oh no, it's just nine. Okay. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Not enough pain. <laughs> yeah, I mean, he took the life lead with that combo, so that's good. Yeah. Very even, very, very even game right now. Um, ooh, gets him with the five. Good stuff. Has to flip a, a jack, though. Yep, he got it. There so. we go. Nice. Okay. So if you want to conserve the hand, you can just do throw jack for 15. Um... <laughs> Stop <Stuff> wave cheating. <laughs> okay, yeah. Tax on the extra damage. Those uh, those even even normals really aren't doing much for you. Yeah. So so that's an easy pitch. Yeah. Uh, burst, crash bomb. Yep. Okay. Still, this is actually a good trade for Riker now in terms of damage, but the the knockdown is unfortunate. It's going to give uh, give Raz a chance to get back in the game if he can. Navigate the uh, the king block throw mix up here. Yep. Um, I haven't seen any kings from Riker yet. Yeah. There's the king. There we go. Good stuff. So essentially, what happened was he dealt they dealt each other 19 damage, and uh, and Raz remains on his back. Mm-hmm. 50 to 26. Uh, so just above the... Crash bomb. Ooh, really? Even cross-up. Uh, it has to be throw that he was trying to beat. Yeah. <laughs> okay, things evening yeah. up a little bit. That That's a weird play. Uh, Raz might burst him on wake up. I mean, I think that tell uh, that's a signal he doesn't have any odd. Ooh! Another crash. Interesting. <laughs> Is that the fourth? No, okay, no. He's just played the two. <laughs> so, Raz might block and then burst, but I think bursting raw is probably better. Dodge. Ooh. Do we have do we have the king? Yeah, face down is very good here. 
Um, Just probably tack in, tack on a six if you don't have lethal for sure. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Okay. There we go. All right. So he took a game. We in there? Looked like a, a messy game. Yeah. Does Does Raz just switch to Troc at this point? Like, or do you mean like? Uh, <laughs> that I would feel be like the... he'll still stick. He yeah. has too much. Pride. Yeah. Oh, uh, I think even if this somehow goes to the last game, it's a pride. It's a pride thing. Like. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so so Riker took a nice game. Oh no, it's game one all over again. <laughs> yep, undercut again. Well, yep. this is on the opposite side because I think Raz got undercut in the first. Uh oh, that was a sick man's two and three. Oof. <laughs> yeah, he might actually be coming out ahead uh, on this combat. <laughs> Combos into the three, the rarely seen two three combo. Yep. Gets Still the jack though. <laughs> Still more damage than a rook throw. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <laughs> wow, unnecessary roughness on commentary, sir. <laughs> no, it's unfortunate. I I want Zane's damage down, ideally. But yeah. Ooh, really bad this. flips uh, that Raz is getting here. Yeah, I think we'll see, like, throw standing nine or J. Yep. Oh, it's just got a handful of J's. Who cares? Big damage. So not looking pretty here. It'll be interesting to see what Raz does. Oh, Just... yeah, and and I mean, like you see the power of shenanigans here because he's still, like, after essentially two three card combos, he's still at essentially exactly the same amount of uh, cards in hand. Okay, does not find the knockdown, but he has hells of life lead to, to work with here. Yeah, but I mean, that can evaporate pretty quick. That's um, true, that's true. Again, still very even on cards, so... Raz sitting in a nice nice position. Good blocks. 3 twos in the discard now for Raz. Good dodge. Yeah, and with this kind of a life lead, um, he's really got him. Like, like Riker really has to go reaching for uh, for throws. Okay, no damage in hand. That's kind of a good thing for for Riker to see. Once again, threatening anarchy. I think as Raz, you just throw into this. It's probably more scary to run into. Uh, into a normal attack than actually eating the anarchy. Oh, I think we might have lost Juju. I'm just getting some pops. Okay. Um... Good throw. Yeah. Yeah, I don't think... I mean, with 85 life, Raz really doesn't need to play scared here. He can just throw into... Um, into the the throw mix-up of uh, anarchy throw. This might be lethal. Uh, you're very quiet. Yeah, I don't know what was. Oh, there we, we go. Yep. Yep. But, you're okay. Uh, we got the finish. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, perfect. <laughs> oh my God! He actually got it. Oh, that's brutal. Yep. Five golden letters. Fast set, but that's what happens if you... If you I mean, this ditto, ditto especially is so, so volatile. Yeah, fast set, and we really didn't learn anything. So, <laughs> I, I think, yeah. uh, but at what cost? <laughs> yeah, I think Riker, this is... I mean, obviously, in a losing scenario, this is the best case scenario. Because, I mean, he hasn't given Raz any information. So, right. I don't know. On the other hand, I don't know, maybe you go for the win instead of disguising your hand. Yeah, I I think that he should have just come out the gate. Like playing playing the ditto to try to scramble is like okay game one. Yeah. But the decision in game two to not switch I think was not very correct. Yeah. Or even um, even just at the end of game two and in, switch into game three. Like yeah, like, I sure feel like you're by fighting that from point, a deficit, but yeah, I I think if you go down like two games against Zane, you're usually not going to win. 
Like, you, you have to keep it as even as you can. Yeah. Yeah, for sure. Well, especially, like, and especially uh, of all Zanes, definitely Raz. Like, yeah. you don't want to let that guy... Uh, oh, go ahead. No, no, no. I was just going to say, uh, you, 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 yeah, you don't want to get, uh, you don't want to have um, Raz go up on games on you, like, generally. Yeah, like, there, there are two, well, maybe three now, actually. There are three players that I, I think you really don't want to give a, a healthy lead. Mm -hmm. um, there's Raziac, there's Deluxe, and there's Clan that I, I'm pretty sure you don't want to give leads to. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, as a general thing, we we don't we don't advise, you know, <laughs> that you give leads to anybody. But yeah, yeah, those are those are particularly scary opponents to uh <clears throat> to play against. Yep. And they don't they don't fold very easily either. So. Yeah. Yeah. Very strong you know, psychologically. Yeah, That's why I kind to... of I, I particularly question the uh uh, the 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 attempt like the psychological warfare attempt of going for the Zane Ditto. <laughs> yeah, I mean I know between the three of us there there's like there's a lot of gamesmanship that goes like between games and yeah, things yeah. like that, uh, especially in casuals. But in tournament, <laughs> and I know I I basically uh, by not playing potentially I think the the stronger options that I was able to play because like I. In my previous sets versus Raz, um, like I had played Valerie because I thought it would be even enough, and I had like a theory going in, but I got down in games. I lost that set four two. Yep. Um, I played against Raz before that. I let Jaina uh, got down in sets and then switched, which I think is really bad against him. Also, um, lost that set like four one. I want to say something like that. Yep. So like it, you really kind of have to come out against Raz, I think, with your, your strongest stuff. Or, I mean, just flat counterpick him. Force the Geiger out or something. Like, yeah. You can you can at least play the carousel at that point. Yeah, but yeah. I think this early on into Panda, I mean, Riker theoretically could eat a loss. True. I, I don't really like it, because uh, I think the competition is too strong. He still has, like, clan to play against. For sure. America did beat Deluxe, and there, there are some trap games, I think, for Riker also that aren't just clan, like Bob, for example. Mm -hmm. um, I, I just, I think you should protect any sort of lead that you have into Panda right now. Definitely. I mean, it's incredibly strong field. Incredibly strong field to be playing. Absolutely. Um, so, yeah, looking forward to, to more matches. Um, okay. And we'll see, we'll see how uh, the young Riker recovers from this, uh, from this defeat. Mm -hmm. uh, do we know who he's uh, playing next? Um, I can pull that real quick. If I... No, it's not Kohai Chan that he has next. It is... See, just beaten Jenga. Lost to Rez. Heart yeah, it is. It's Hartley. Oh, yeah. okay. Okay. Um who he is positive in sets with and he has a buy no, he has five ec after that, actually. Okay. Um and five ec is another I mean obviously five ec is a strong player. Yeah. Uh that's another trap game, I think. Like I, I kind of expect Riker to probably win, but um you really can't count out five ec. He's too strong really to do that. Yeah, yeah. That dude's Setsuki is terrifying. Yeah, absolutely terrifying. So cool. So we'll see. Uh, uh, I really hope we can uh, cast that match with uh, Riker and Hartley. That's I like. I really like watching Hartley play. Yep. Uh, um, unfortunately, he got killed for not throwing too much. Uh, he he threw a lot in the game that he won against Leontis. Yeah. But uh, it seemed like, for whatever reason, he got a little nervous. Probably, probably. I think it, it's the the early trap against grapplers with like lower health characters where mm -hmm. you on the counter throw or you guess wrong and let them build cards yeah then they get that lead and you know you start getting hit for throws and stuff like that but you still have to like have the fortitude and i think getting thrown kind of scared him off and allowed leon just to really just kind of get the game going in the direction that he wanted to mm -hmm. yeah it was a it was a good set i'll, I'll uh, i'm looking forward to uh i watch it on stream but uh I'll, i'm looking forward to seeing that uh I'll probably link to it and uh, or share it on uh, on Google Plus. Mm -hmm. 
So thank you very much for jumping on uh, what turned out to be a very, <laughs> a very quick commentary. <laughs> yeah, Pleasure as always, casting with you. Yeah, <laughs> oh, that's awesome. So I'll see you all next time, and uh, enjoy yourself some Yomi. <laughs>